My name is Sandy Roth, and I've been a volunteer guardian at Lytham in Hernando County for over 17 years. I've served in over 120 cases and seen 300 of your children go through the school system here. 167 years ago, Preston Brooks, a pro-slavery member of the U.S. House of Representatives, notoriously caned Senator Charles Sumner, an abolitionist nearly to death in an attack labeled symbolic of the breakdown of reasoned discourse that led to the Civil War. At the establishment of Brooksville that same year, the town chose to honor the aforementioned Preston Brooks with the city's name. Those events held position in our community's greatest shame until just a few weeks ago, when the actions of some components of this school board brought national attention, ridicule, and renewed disgrace to our community. The accusation that a PG Disney movie, the heart of which was about a science lesson, is somehow stripping children of their innocence, we all know is bogus. If keeping children innocence is the goal, I suggest that this board remove the Bible from the board's approved materials list because it's loaded with stories of cruelty and violence, rape, murder, vengeance and wrath, castration, genocide, slaughter, human sacrifice, dismemberment, sexual violence, enslavement, crucifixion, and drowning. I remind you of the Hernanda County School Board's vision statement to prepare students for a successful transition into a diverse and changing world, and the statement that accompanies your stated objectives to embed critical thinking and problem solving in the learning opportunities for all students. And the statement of your priorities, teacher retention. If this board supports these actions, the and politically motivated claim, then none of these aforementioned uh, goals can ever be achieved. We are surrounded by the diversity of our children in a world that you already recognize as diverse. This board should be focused on supporting all of our children, keeping them safe from anyone, even those in your midst who would promote cruelty and hate and thus prepare these children for, as you claim in your vision statement, a successful transition into a diverse and changing world. To paraphrase Wanda Sykes, until a drag queen walks into a school and beats eight kids to death with a copy of... Thank you. Thank you. Easy, easy, 